Come on and show me some love. It's your girl Elaine. Welcome back to my channel. Please like and subscribe. How's everybody doing today? It is Sunday. So I had my virtual church this morning and I went out and got some groceries because the house was kind of empty. This is my apartment. Me and my daughter is sharing. This is the kitchen. It's coming along really good. My theme or my color um, for my kitchen is sort of like black and white because I'm finding myself buying a lot of black and white mixed in with a little bit of cream but it all blends in together and um, this is my electric stove now you know I came from working on gas stove so this is electric so I, I'm working it I'm figuring it out <laughs> and there's my little welcome board um, sometimes I, I'm thinking about putting like a little, little morning scripture to get us going in the morning, me and my daughter. Um, that's another scene that I, I'm going to show in another video, just the courtyard of my apartment building. I have some silverware here that I have had for a minute. Um, what I got to do is wash them down and sterilize. I don't know. What do you all know about sterilization of your silverware back? But the OGs back in the day, we always sterilize our silverware. And what I mean by that, you wash them, you put them in a boiling pot, and then you use them. So hopefully people are still doing that. But if not, that's what I think you need to do when you get new silverware. Wash them, get a pot, some water, and let them boil. Not like, you know, until the water boils out, but you know, you just wait till the water get boiled. I brought some fruit because, like I said, I'm all into the fruit. So these are my apples and bananas. This is a um, bread box. Me and my daughter, we don't really eat bread, but it's always good to have bread because, you know, my grandkids be over sometimes. So if they want a sandwich, so be it. I just picked up this uh, microwave from Walmart today. So that's all good. Then I have this little spinner. Uh, well, when it spins. But I have this little spinner to stick up. It spins, but I don't know why it's not spinning now, but it does spin. <laughs> but anyway, so it's a little spin. I just brought it. I just thought it was some kind of decoration that I can use. I put the salt and pepper on. Um, I do have my little canisters here. Let me turn the light. There we go. So therefore, I do have my little canisters here that I'm filling up still. I do have uh, my spaghetti and my rice and then my elbow macaroni. And then I don't know what I'm going to use these two containers for. I don't know yet. I don't know. I'm, I'm still working on that. But hey, it's a start. Everything's a start. Then I here I have my utensils by the sink. Here's my sink. Sorry, a little messy. Thank you. So I count my utensils utensil um, jar here to put my utensils in once I take them out of the dishwasher this is my chopping board right here um, I do have another chopping board that my daughter got I gotta go get that from her house because it's at her house and she thinks she's keeping it uh uh but um and it's wooden too so I have to go over it's three of them so I, I can leave for like one <laughs> but anyway this is a one chopping board it's just for now um and then I do have a drying rag even though I have a dishwasher, I still have a drying rag just in case if I just have a little, you know, a little something, something like my grandson's cup, a plate and thing. I just put it on this drying rag. Oh, that's my father always watching over me. Then I have my little decorations here for harvest season because I am like very into the little harvest season giddy up me. So I got my little harvest decoration next to my father along with my, um, pumpkin candle I love the smell of pumpkin spice nice aroma in the house um these little containers i got from i don't know where i got them from i think they were like 50 cent i picked them up like you know what always can use them so you know i'm just gonna actually keep them actually i'm gonna put them over here because in this section here will be where i put my silverware so um I'll just open them over here. Then over here, I have another utensil um, jar. And I brought one and forgot I had one and brought another one. But I said, you know, it works out great because I can put all my knives, you know, big silverware, my wooden spoons over in here by the stove. Then I have this little um, crunch here where I can put some cookies possibly. 
um, or some goodies in these jars here, just in case I get hungry for a nice nap. Put them in here. And, oh, this is my board that I write down little different things real quick. I So far, I had the cereal on top of the refrigerator, which I thought was kind of cool just to put it up there, you know. Because sometimes, you know, in the cabinets, it's not big enough to put cereal, see? Unless you lay it down. Oh, and so over my stove, I did put in my spices. Just the beginning of them. Not really that many, but, you know, and I have that. That is definitely on a spinner. I mean, the other one is on a spinner too, but I don't know. It's not working for me today. Um, then this other cabinet over here. I haven't decided what I'm going to put in that one, so there's nothing in that one. But over here, I have, um, like, my um, salad dressings and ketchup and all the tall items up here. Up here is, like, chips and stuff. And at the very top, I got the um, noodles just in case my granddaughter come over because she loves noodles. Then this cabinet here, I'm going to be putting my canned goods and other little things in here, like... Um, my grits. Gotta have grits. I got a lot of grits. Gotta have grits. Um, this is uh, some more news. Elbow macaroni news. Yeah, I can't fit the other. That's why I remember to put it there. And her cream of wheat. Sorry. And we got some piano cake batter. So, just always want to keep stuff for my grandkids. This one I haven't decided what I'm going to use. Right now I just put medication in there that I want to keep hidden from my grandkids. I found this little bake bowl from Home Goods. I thought this was really good. And it was on clearance. So, see? Clearance. <laughs> Got to do the clearance. My man, clearance. And then this cabinet here, I have my plates and my bowls set up in here. I do have a little runner that I'm going to put down but right now this is where my pates and bowls I think I may move my cups and yeah I think I may move the cups and stuff um, but I'm still working on them and um, that's about it I have my pots and pans down the bottom here like I said that's gonna be my utensils over here I have my oils um, this is where I keep foil and stuff in this drawer here. This one I have made my drunk jar, kind of. And I got another one that's a drunk jar. But eventually it won't be a drunk jar. I'm going to cut this up and put it over there, these knives and stuff, and use this drawer for something else because it's pretty wide. Then up under the sink here, I have the detergent and paper towels and my iron, which are mine. It's going to go out in the outdoor cabinet out there and again like I said this is my dishwasher which is good to have I love dishwasher and that's about it all of the kitchen kind of tour I have room up top so I can put um you know little decorations on the top that's what that's what I will use you know you usually put things on that you forget about <laughs> but I so far I'm loving it it works for me it works for my daughter and so I am just happy about everything. It's all white. Floors are all nice and salat. That's my cat over there. Um, so, <laughs> yeah. So this is it. And this is where I'm living. This is where I'm hanging out. And this is where I'm, I'm going to presume most of my videos. So please like and subscribe and come back. And like I said, always continue praying for me because I'm going to pray for you no matter what. Love you and have a good week. Bye.